All right, so we're heading out to day one of the Lang Tang track. This is my guide Nishan. He's his job is to get this old middle-aged guy up to Hello, the top. <laughs> so he's got a tough job ahead of him. But how do you think I'm going to do? Am I going to make it? Yes. Okay. Good. So let's go see. Let's get started. On well, my first bridge of the track, very high up. <laughs> if you're afraid of heights, this wouldn't be great, but it doesn't bother me too much. It seems pretty secure, a little bouncy. Yeah, I did too. So perfect. And so a lot of the trail has been uh, damaged. Um, so it's kind of a detour. We we're going to go down this side, the left side of the river. We're going to take the right side of the river. The other path kind of took a detour. Wow, very beautiful. Look at this view. If you watch my last trekking video, you know my problem with lots of stairs. We've got quite a few here. Shouldn't be as much as this one as my Kathmandu Valley track, but whew, I'm already feeling it. And also when you start this trek, uh, the original trail um, went up the left side of the river. There was a landslide, that took out the main trail to Lang Tang. You can still kind of cross it, uh, but the safer way is to take your first bridge uh, to the right side, uh, which is a little less scenic because it's this big, um, you know, carved out road you can see behind me, but much safer. We saw people trying to cross the landslide. It looked a little scary from this side of the river and eventually you'll cross back over. Well, so far, disappointingly, a lot of this trail is these big construction projects. They're just kind of building roads and quarries. I'm not sure what else, but it's this beautiful valley and got these big pits and dump trucks. Uh, so hopefully this stops a little farther on up. And behind me is a bridge uh, was destroyed in the 2015 earthquake. A big boulder came down, crushed it. I've seen this in other YouTubers videos, Harold Balder and uh, Gabriel Traveler. I think they both walked across and it looked really dangerous, but from their videos, I've, I think there's a tr separate trail and bridge across. So we're gonna go try and find that. Yeah, so the video's to the right side of the broken bridge. If you're running, it's kind of hidden and out of sight. So you can't really see it, so it's right there. There's the original bridge.
Well, the dusty road has ended. Um, we're back um, on a traditional trekking trail here. Stairs and beautiful views. Um, so, very exciting. Of course, this also means it's harder and more tiring to walk. But that's the price you pay for beauty and adventure. So we stopped at a little tea house here for a break. Whew. Some incredible views. <laughs> Not a bad place to stop. Get your breath, grab something to drink. Well, we had a quick break. Something did. Bought some cookies. <laughs> Getting a little hungry. Now we're back to it. We got a maybe a couple more hours till we get to our lunch break. of stairs we're making pretty good elevation gain still feeling pretty good yeah, have to take a break every now and then but making pretty good progress today uh, whew, still out of shape but still doing pretty well Yeah. 
Uh, so I've stopped here in the town of Bamboo. It's about almost 11.30. So about, up to about 8 in the morning. Made some good progress here. Beautiful view for our lunch. Let's see what they got to eat. Most of these places have pretty much the same stuff on the menu. We'll take a look. Thank you. What you got? So I got the uh, egg chow mein, or something I usually get. Got a lot of kind of good energy in it. So let's see, it looks good. Nice, very good flavor. Mm -hmm. Egg got a little protein to it. And my guy got the dal ba, that looks pretty amazing too. Wow. So we're done with a very tasty lunch. Our next stop is uh, the Llama Hotel. Uh, it's about a two and a half hour walk. I'm guessing mostly uphill, but we'll see. Going straight up, a lot of rocky steps. Kind of tough on your legs and ankles, but, and your breathing. <laughs> but gotta keep going. Well, I made it to the town of Lama Hotel up here. Just a few scattered buildings. Uh, we're staying in this uh, tea house behind me. Uh, it was a long, arduous day, a lot of steps. I stopped filming about the last third because the trail was getting kind of treacherous. I had to put my camera down, so. They got a little stove where they do the cooking here. And the table. So my room is up these stairs. So here's my room pretty basic and kind of just plywood walls and a window and two basic beds I brought my own sleeping bag get a view of the area downstairs I think it'll be pretty quiet tonight so pretty basic but nice I get this room all to myself um, which is a plus 
and I'm gonna take a nap before dinner because I'm pretty tired.